Good evening, everyone. We begin tonight with a story you won't see anywhere else. It involves a couple of thieves and some alert police officers who found a lot more than a couple of criminals when they went to make an arrest. Angela Ingram is in Florence with this Local 12 exclusive. Angela. Well, Rob, this was a story of people who were accused of a shoplifting spree. It started out in Bellevue, ended up here in Florence, and police say they were in and out of stores up and down this strip, which is Mall Road. They were filling a shopping cart full of items and then running out of the store with the stolen items, but things went badly for them. When a police officer happened to look in his rearview mirror and realized that the suspects were right behind him. These two laptops started out at a Bellevue store, but ended up at the Florence Police Department. Officers say they were stolen from UHR rental store around 2 o'clock this afternoon. Two black males in their late 40s came in, distracted one of the uh, counter workers there. While he was distracted, the other one took two laptops off the counter and ran out of the store. Police say the two men involved are Randall Whitehead and Kenneth Rankins. A short time after the theft in Bellevue, Florence police got a call about shoplifters at Shoe Carnival. Corporal Ryan Harvey stopped the suspects on Mall Road and found a car full of stolen property. Multiple items with uh, price tags, no bags, uh, receipts. Um, no uh, discernible reason for them being there, multiple, multiple of the same items, uh, bedding sets, uh, home decor, things like that. The thieves even stole Christmas decorations. Harvey called in the serial numbers on the computers and traced them back to Bellevue. The business had uh, written their phone number, their store number and uh, telephone number on the bottom. And when I contacted them, I provided them the serial number and they said that uh, they had just reported those computers stolen. Officers say the shoplifting spree is a cautionary tale. If you do this, you'll likely get charged with felonies. I was real happy before I could get it into uh, the link and NCIC. It was already reported, you know, that was recovered. And that, that's, that's great when you can get something like that recovered that fast. And police say at the Sears outlet, these gentlemen actually took a suitcase, filled the suitcase up with tools, and then proceeded to steal both the suitcase and the tools that were inside. Officers are telling me tonight they see an uptick in these kinds of crimes around the Christmas holidays. Reporting live, Angela Ingram, Local 12 News. Rob, back to you. Tis the season for this kind of crime. Thanks very much. The two suspects are in the Boone County Jail tonight, facing several charges.